may have seen this woman at the forefront of the fight for equity and police reform in Charlotte, taking part in protests all over town these past few weeks. Well, next week, Cass Otley will share a stage with CMPD officers and other panelists for a town hall that will air right here on Channel 9. Our Tina Terry spoke to her about the change she's hoping will come from that discussion. My husband wanted to move here for his job, and so I came, and I, I loved it. I thought it was beautiful here and stayed. Cass Otley has lived in Charlotte for 22 years, but she says it didn't take long for her to see inequities throughout the city. Just driving around Charlotte, you notice, uh, okay, certain areas are beautiful and have sidewalks. I just started noticing different things. It fueled her passion for social reform, and she says officer-involved shootings like that of Keith Lamont Scott in Charlotte and George Floyd's murder hundreds of miles away caused that passion to burn. We took to the streets immediately. Like, we just all met up, and we were like, okay. We're, you know, and then the crowd just grew and grew and grew, and just like what Keith Lamont Scott. For weeks, she's taken part in March after March, pushing for reform she says could prevent police brutality. She supports reforms like a ban on chokeholds, more de-escalation training, warnings before shooting, exhausting all alternatives before shooting, a duty to intervene, a ban on shooting at moving cars, use of force continuum, and a requirement that all force be reported. Get them off of me! She also supports redirecting some CMPD funds toward efforts that prevent crime. And if we took some of that money and put it into the underserved communities, into some after school programs, into some job creation, we wouldn't have the crime that we have. In Charlotte, Tina Terry, Channel 9 Eyewitness News. Otley is part of a special town hall event next week that Channel 9 will carry live. It's called Talking About Race and Police Reform. It airs Wednesday night at 7 here on Channel 9.